Hey, what's up you guys? Today we're going to show you how to load your Chevy Silverado 1500 six foot bed on a U-Haul car hauler. Now before we do that, let's go ahead and prep our towing vehicle and our car hauler. First, make sure that the towing vehicle is in park with the parking brake set. Double check the trailer's wiring harness, coupler, and safety chains to make sure that they are securely attached to the towing vehicle. At the front of the trailer, free the tire straps from the ratchets. Pull the ratchet handle up, then pull the strap out of the ratchet and towards the rear of the trailer, laying them flat on the deck. Then repeat on the other side. Release the front safety chain from the D-ring for ease of access later. Next, lower the driver's side fender, release the two latches, one located in the front, the other located at the rear. Now rotate the fender down. Now prepare the loading ramps by releasing the latches that are holding the ramps in place and pulling the ramps completely out. Then repeat on the other side. Release the rear safety chain from the D-ring for ease of access later. Center the vehicle to be loaded behind the car carrier. While loading the vehicle, drive slowly and have an observer make sure the front of the vehicle does not hit the ramps. During the loading process, make sure your guide stands off to the side. Continue slowly up the ramps and onto the trailer until the vehicle's tires come to rest against the stops at the front of the trailer. Before exiting the vehicle, be sure to place the vehicle in park and engage the parking brake. Position the straps up and over the front tires, making sure that they are centered over the tire. Move each strap ratchet left or right to align it with the center of the tire. Route the strap through the slot on the ratchet spool, making sure at least 6 inches of the strap passes through the spool. Tighten the ratchet, folding the handle down when done. Then repeat on the other side. Finish securing the vehicle by fastening the security chains to the frame or other structural member. Leave some slack in the chain, looping them around and securing them through an open link through the S-hooks. You will have to do this at the front and the back of the vehicle. Stow the ramps by lifting them and sliding the back until the latches re-engage and are correctly securing the ramps. Raise the driver's side fender and secure it with both latches. Recheck the tire straps and all hookup connections after the first 5 miles, again after 50 miles, and thereafter at all stops during your travels. For more information, you can visit your closest U-Haul store or uhaul.com.